Today's review is going to be an update on the Amber Ride holster for my G2C Torres 9mm. We will take out that, make sure there is nothing. It's all cleared. We're good. I'll set that aside. Now, I wore this holster for three days on my motorcycle. I have a, a Harley Davidson 883 Sportster. We did a three day ride from Fort Worth to Junction and did the Twisted uh, Three Sisters. The whole time I was wearing the Amber Ride holster with my nine millimeter. Torres G2C, I had no issues whatsoever. It felt perfect. It felt comfortable. I'm very impressed with this holster. Low profile inside the waistband. The clip was, was good. I might have to put the tension a little bit uh, tighter. I didn't have any issues with it, but I think uh, for my liking, a little bit tighter will be will be a perfect fit for me. Now on the first review I did, or uh, pretty much the unboxing, um, I didn't see it, but it was down there. It does come with the Allen wrench to tighten it, which is pretty cool. And so I did the three day ride uh, and it was comfortable. Uh, some of the times I couldn't even feel it. I would have to reach back and see if it was actually there. I'm not used to carrying inside the waistband uh, and it just felt that comfortable to where I couldn't even uh, notice that it was on uh, on my side. It was perfect fit for my G2C, which I, I purchased both the, the same day. Uh, uh, it took one day to arrive. Now my next upgrade for this, it's gonna be Talon grips. I just uh, ordered them and they arrived today. And here they are. I tore up the instructions a little bit. But anyways, here they are. I'm gonna put those on there and see how they how they feel. Instructions are uh, pretty easy. I checked them out online. So I'll have to check that out because of the alcohol wipe. I'll do an update review on that. But as far as is of the holster, uh, low profile, hard plastic, uh, fit, uh, feels real good. I do wear a t-shirt underneath. So I had no issue with the plastic rubbing up against my skin uh, because I have a t-shirt. If you do not wear a t-shirt underneath, I'm not sure how it's going to feel for you. Uh, but as far as for me, with the t-shirt underneath, it felt perfect. So I'll go ahead and leave you with that. I'll be doing a couple of videos on, on upgrades I do to my Taurus G2C 9mm. Um, for the ride to the Twisted Sisters, uh, I used a GoPro. This one is the Hero 5. I've got to download the images and, and I'll be able to upload the video uh, from the Twisted Sisters. Uh, I'll be uploading a little bit more videos on the shed. I had just had the shed built uh, by Tough Shed. It's a 10 by 16 shed. I I built the shelf. I just need to get the plywood up there. I just ran all my electrical. Just got the uh, box there ready for uh, my breakers. Ran those, plugged those in. I did a little AC unit, uh, Toshiba AC and heater unit. Uh, rig that up so it'll uh, spit all the hot air out. I got some insulation ready to put up. I'm using some ramps to get in on my bike. It has a little slope, but I got the double doors in here so it's wide enough uh, where I can fit my bike in here, no, no problems. Once I do that, I'll put a video on that, but this is my 883 Sportster. I know this videos on the review on the grips but i'm just wanting to tell everybody a couple of videos coming soon i'll do a couple of videos on some upgrades i did to the, uh, my sportster 
but thanks for watching and stay tuned for some more videos.